What's up? Here Dr. BC and in this video episode, I will show you the full performance review of OnePlus One, the fastest Android KitKat smartphone on the planet. This is my OnePlus One. For our previous video on this one, please click on the link flashing on your screen. Now in this video episode, I will show you the full performance review of this one. First of all, I will show you the Android version that is installed on this device. As you can see that the Android on this device is from Cyanogen and it is 11 and the Android version is 4.4.2 that is a Android KitKat. Now go back. So this device has Cyanogen mode 11. If your device doesn't have this Cyanogen mode, it is on color OS, then you can install this Cyanogen mode on this OnePlus One. That is a very easy. See our installation videos that is link is flashing on your screen now i will proceed to the full performance review of this phone now first of all i will show you the unto to benchmark tap to open and then tap test and then test this will definitely take some time i will fast forward this video for you Okay, as you can see that my one plus one is top on the list. It scored 37343. That is the topest on this N22 benchmark. As you can see that on S5, the total score is 32967. So this one plus one gets a very pretty score. That is a topest in the list. So that's why I'm calling this one plus one as a fastest Android KitKat smartphone on the planet. Till now, it is only one device which score more than this uh, HTC One M8. Now, I will show you the detail. As you can see that the CPU is good and support large apps and the multitasking RAM is excellent 2D graphics, excellent 3D graphics and uh, support large mobile games. UX multitask 7474, runtime 3864. RAM operation 1635, RAM speed 2755, CPU integer 3587, CPU float point 3958 and 2D graphics 1701, 3D graphics 9960, storage 1744, IO 665. So this gets a very good score on this unto 2 scale, not now. And if you see the device info and you can see that the brand is OnePlus model 1. Android version that is KitKat, CPU from Qualcomm and GPU Adreno 330, resolution 180 into 1920, rear camera 13.1 and IMA number having root SS, yes, RAM total 2893 MB, system storage 54.87 GB, internal storage 54.87 GB, the CPU model Qualcomm Snapdragon 801 MSM 8974 AC cores 4 and frequency from 300 megahertz to 2457.6 megahertz. You can see that uh, display render that is Adreno 330. The vendor is Qualcomm. GPU, CPU frequency, resolution. The size is 5.5 material IPS. The pixel density 840 DPI. And the rear camera that is 13.1 megapixel. It can support up to 4K. Front facing camera 5 megapixel, battery level currently 33%, weight 160 gram and that's mean that is taking from the website, not the real time. Android version KitKat and in the last you can see that this can support the direction, G, acceleration, light sensor, e-compass, proximity and gyro and linear acceleration and rotation vector and this temperature, pressure, ambient temperature and humidity is not in this device. Now let's quit this test mark okay okay i first of all i will clean the background processes the next benchmark that i want to show you is quadrant standard tap to open and okay and run full benchmark again this will take time i will fast forward this for you so this quadrant standard has completed Tap yes to sending this benchmark for online. As you can see that this device is again top on this quadrant standard that total it get 23782 score. And if you see the split score, total 23782 CPU 90957 memory 16908 IO 7949 2D 
सेवन फोर फोर थ्री डी टू थ्री फाइव थ्री सो अगेन दिस इज अ वेरी गुड डिवाइस अकॉर्डिंग टू दिस क्वार स्टैंडर्ड नाउ लेट स्क्विट दैट एंड क्लीन द बैकग्राउंड प्रोसेस नाउ द नेक्स्ट बेंच मार्क इज नैना मार्क टू दैट इज टू टेस्टिंग द जी पी यू अगेन दिस इज माई फर्स्ट रन टैप दिस रन Wow, amazing! Sixty-one point nine FPS. Publish. So you can see that this device is top on this Nanomark two standard, and here the GL vendor Qualcomm and GL render Adreno three thirty. Now close that. Now again clean the background process. Okay, tap and hold, and then clean. Now the next benchmark that I want to show you that is a not a benchmark that tells you the specification of this phone that is CPU Jet. Again, you can see that this has carried 400 CPU architecture and model is Qualcomm. I have already tell you that is the four cores. Currently CPU load is 15 percent and let's see the system. Okay, all of the thing is same. Root SS no according to. CPU jet, but according to Antutu, the root SSD is yes. Now see the battery, power status battery, temperature and voltage. Now see, let's see the sensor, accelerometer, magnetometer, gyro, IR, no, ambient, gravity, rotation. Uh, that is the list of the sensor that is installed on this one plus one. Now nothing more. Let's quit this. Okay, cancel that. Quit this CPU jet. Now the next test I want to show you is multi-touch test. tap this and now put this phone on the bench and put all of the finger as you can see that this is recognizing okay there is some problem okay i will manage to get 10 touch points on this phone so the multi touch tester predict that this display has 10 touch points now quit that and now i will show you the temple run 2 on this phone that is a not a benchmark but this will tell you how this phone perform on the games as you can see that this loaded very fast now first of all i will show you the viewing angle as you can see that the display is very nice and you will uh, see the display from any extreme angle at any side as you can see that this game has no issue the graphics is very good and there is no hang and no lag while playing this game on this one plus one so you can see that in overall the performance of this one plus one is pretty good and you will hardly feel any problem while using this one plus one till now the one plus one is the fastest phone on this planet let's see when note 4 come This completed the full performance review of One Plus One. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. The subscription link is shown on your screen. For more videos on this One Plus One, like uh, unboxing, uh, gaming experience, and full review, keep watching BCD Tech. Thank you and have a nice day. Bye bye.